Uh, Korean fried chicken. That's all I have left. Pretty full. I hate to leave, but I gotta make some more money because I spent quite a bit. But uh, it was good being back. It was good seeing my friend. And last day, we're gonna go to Chinatown. Let's go. Check out Neko Sushi. It's an all you can eat sushi buffet. And it's like $25. So the place I wanted to go to, Neko Sushi, is closed. It said it was open around like 4.30, 5 p.m. But uh <clears throat> we can go see some other stuff. We're just gonna look around until we find something. Six place isn't open until 12 p.m. It's about like 11:30. <clears throat> Gonna look around a bit more, maybe get some tea. A tea way plus, and I just got a uh, tiger brown sugar milk tea, and then I got coffee jelly in it. Looks good. Let's try it out. If that's the one I got. Coffee jelly tastes good. Yeah. yeah I love brown, I love brown sugar. Good tea. I recommend it. You guys want some brown sugar? Check that out. just opened it's a Korean barbecue so let's go check it out so they started me out with some side dishes uh, I'm not sure what these are actually but uh, this is a spicy Korean cucumber and I think this is kimchi and also don't know what that is they have like chili oil uh, looks like butter or something else. Sesame oil. This looks like sesame oil and then chili oil. And then I had a hot tea and a green tea. I got the uh, steamed rice. For the appetizers, I got the shit, which is like a California roll, deep fried. Uh, Korean fried chicken. Garlic butter, seaweed salad. Uh, short rib. Revival spicy pork belly and spicy squid and a mushroom plate. And then I got the two drinks. You good man? Last time I was at a Korean buffet was in Thailand, so 
makes the hot tea, the veggies. This is the, uh, I think this is the pork belly. And uh, the shit and uh, Korean fried chicken. Hot green tea. Oops. It's good. Nice like green tea. Just like all. It's like uh, regular green tea. We're trying to appetizers. Uh, Korean fried chicken. This good. There's like little sesame seeds on it. It's, the sauce tastes good. It's like sweet. Uh, this is the chef. It's like a. It has like crab meat inside of it. It's like a fried seaweed roll. Really good. So this is like spicy mayo. And I think this is uh, some kind of sweet sauce. It is really good. Mm. Here's, here's a side dish. This is the radish. I think they use different. It's like pickled, but it's like different stuff inside of each one. Tastes good. And then this, I don't know what this is. I think it's tofu. Korean cucumber kimchi. has a hot Korean pepper place on it. Sesame oil. Tastes good. This is just a uh, regular kimchi. Tastes good, nice and fresh. And I don't, I don't know what this is. Might be potato salad. That's some corn inside of it. Yeah, I think it's like potatoes and corn. It's, it's uh, a little sweet. It's good. I really love the shit. It's good. Sesame seeds in it. Saucy. Tastes good. So I did my mushrooms and garlic and butter. Are you guys doing okay? Yeah, I'm doing good. Thank you. The other one was a beef bulgogi. 
This is shortbread. This is the pork belly and squid and the mushrooms dipped in garlic sauce. But this bulgogi is really good and also this short rib is amazing. This beef bulgogi inside the sesame oil. The sesame oil is nice. It's buttery, creamy. The sesame E oil. This is a uh, pork belly. Bulgogi is my favorite one out of all of them. So I got another round of it. And this sauce, both of these sauces are good. The spicy, all the spicy items weren't that spicy, but it was still good. <clears throat> it has like a sweet, sweet and a little bit spicy taste to it. But uh, the garlic, garlic is amazing. all I have left. I'm pretty full. said there's small size and a big size. Oh wow. <laughs> How sassy you are there? Uh I'll just do a small size. So this is the Yuzu tea with the boba. Uh 
aloe vera and lychee jelly. Let's try it. pretty good it's like sour tangy and sweet but it's 25% sweet you can adjust the sweet level it's good